don't have to wake up, but open your eyes. What's the matter? Somebody hit you? Here. Let me help. You. Oh my god. Andrew, you getting these alerts? Kind of busy here. It sounds like real trouble. At the engine, they said Hope made a lateral ascension. What do you hope? Shit. They're not happy about it? No. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. Come on. All right, um... Wow. Hello everyone, my name is Stitches. Um, I didn't expect that to be such a crazy intro. Uh, we already got like, mad into it. Uh, this is the DLC for Outlast called Whistleblower. And as you can see, this is the email that Ethan got in the beginning. And I'm going to be pressing a button to be sending that email to Ethan, which was the main protagonist. Oh. I'm guessing this protagonist is also pretty quiet. Park? They've paged for you three times already. There's something urgent at the engine. Oh, so we're a scientist. What are you doing here anyway? I thought you were just a software guy. Yeah, I can't go in there. I'm worried about you. You're Waylon, aren't you? Why not you answering the page? I'll tell them you're incoming. All right, so my name is Waylon. Do I go this way? Yeah. That sounds all right. Huh. Price Waylon, hurry up. They're waiting on you. It's the engine. close. Next patient thing coming out to the still dark. We need you at the front terminal. They've got Gluskin out of his cell. Page him again. We need this park guy in here now. Tell me, park. Finally, where have you been? Functional imaging and faces and talking to the ASL. We got a patient 30 seconds out and we're blind inside his head. Call into the chamber. Ask them to delay. No. Huh. We need another performance evaluation. Mr. Park here is going to have us up and running before we even know it. Right, Mr. Park? Well, what did that say? I'd, I want to see that. Do I press something? Happy, Mr. Park? Uh, Steve? FMRI is still dark. You're doubting our friend, Mr. Wayland Park? Which I consider more than unkind to his programming skill and considerable dedication to the Murkoff Corporation. <laughs> Fuck me, they're bringing him in. No. Is that Billy Hope? This is a high security. It's all right, Agent. Mr. Park was just surprised. I'm sure he's still calm and eager to finish his work. Take your seat. This the guy that licked me in the beginning? Put on the left? Park. Hit me to roll up the fusion monitoring is not active when we put him in the engine. Five seconds. Four. Three. Arterial spin oh my gosh. Good. Positioning imaging they broke his tooth for this as well, I think. You're finished, Mr. Wayland Park. You can leave. Don't expect anything but honesty in my review of your performance. Alright. Sure. 
Hold on. You need to exit the room, sir. Yeah, and I'm exiting. Yeah, no tech. I'm wearing casual wear. I don't look like anything like these guys here. How come I'm not in a suit? Alright, I'm guessing I'm gonna be cut off when I go in here. There's no way I just get an easy pass. Knew it. Hands where I can see him. Ow! Mr. Whalen Park. Consulting contract 8208. Software engineer with a level three security clearance. Graduated cum laude from Berkeley, but still somehow not smart enough to realize that the last thing a fly ought to do in a spider's web is wiggle. Somehow dumb enough to think that a borrowed laptop, onion router, and firewall patch would be enough to fool the world's leading supplier of biometric security. Stupid, Mr. Park. More than stupid, in fact. That was crazy. I'm afraid we're going to have to have you committed. Mr. Park, will you willingly submit to forced confinement? Did you hear that, Agent? He said yes, Mr. Blair. Oh, shit. Oh, and uh, did I just hear Mr. Whalen Park volunteer for the Morphogenic Engine Program? No. So I heard, Mr. Blair. That was brave indeed, Whalen. The Murkoff Corporation and the Onward March of Science both appreciate your bravery and sacrifice. Maybe you could administer Mr. Park here a light anesthetic. Gladly. Uh, that is not light. <laughs> Whistleblower. Oh, wait, I just realized we're back in the same place. Looks like then I'm a little crazy. Oh shit. The lights turned off. Oh, the guy behind me is so dead. The guy behind me is dead. Oh my god. What's that? Look at her nose real quick. If I die, I fucked up. Oh god, where am I? Hours could have passed or weeks. Brain filled with static. They made me watch the engine. I have to get a help. Have to call for help. Lisa, I'm sorry. If I die, I know you'll find me. I know you won't rest until you find my body. I hope you find this camera with my corpse. I hope the evidence on it does what I couldn't expose. What I couldn't exposes the truth. Lisa, baby, I'm so sorry. I fucked up. I thought I was doing the right thing, but I fucked up bad. Oh, shit. Me out. You think you're stationed there? Flower. Pretty flower. Fucking. I'll open you up. I'll open you up and show you. Oh, so I'm gonna have to immediately you run, aren't right I? There. Oh shit. What's happening here? Hey man. Oh my god. Oh, alright. Am I dead? Alright. Just making sure. Oh, battery. That's nice. I think I'm safe now. Oh, you locked the door on me. There's gotta be more batteries. Oh, wow! Oh my 
god. Sorry, man. Oh, all right. Didn't know he cut me off. I'm leaving. Don't worry. Ah! Ah! Shit! Fuck! Oh my god! Oh! Come back here! No, fuck off! I don't want you. I don't. I don't want to talk to you. What do I do? Here? Oh, that's him! The fucking ghost. There's a radio in the prison. Shortwave. If it's electronic, I can make it talk. Make it work for me. There's hope, Lisa. I'm coming home to you. My mistake was subly, like you always said. I thought leaking information to a few journalists was the safer way. I didn't want the spotlight. The attention. Murkoff is dangerous, I know that. I thought I had to be subtle for your sake, Lisa. For the boys. But I should have exposed what Murkoff is doing to the world. Should have shouted at anyone and everyone. I can't die. Not before I reach the radio. They can't cover this up now. It's too broken, too dangerous. Holy cow. This DLC is going like real strong right now. You get the vibe immediately. Alright, push this over. Um, hi, man. I'm gonna... You stay in there. Alright. What was that? Am I fucked? That sound. I'm a doctor. I need to get hold of my. You're not security. I was. I'm a patient like you. Stole these clothes from a dead body I found. You gotta get me out of here, please. Just push the button. Open the door. We can get out of here together. All right. Oh no. No! 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 Oh my gosh. Dude, you're fucked in the head. The doctors are sick. I never seen a man die before today. Never seen a dead body outside of a coffin. Dozens today murdered and worse. I looked in one into one man's eyes as another tore him to pieces. Claimed he was a doctor, then saw the rags they've dressed me in and changed his story. Said he was a patient. Could have been either. They're all crazy, all sick. No real difference between them now. The therapy is spreading. And what am I? I watched this man die and only thought, it's not me, thank God. I know I'll die someday. I don't want to be murdered. Shit. Wait, am I stuck here? Alright, I thought that was like a different thing. Fuck me. This way. Another one's coming. 
open the door. Wait for me, man. Wait, is there? Lord. Are you fucking kidding me? This asshole locked it. Apparently another one's coming. Oh. Okay, so... I gotta really figure out what I'm doing here. Um... Critical thinking skills, please come in. Up this pallet. Uh, come on, man. Can I not walk up this? Oh, alright. That's all I've been saying. Where is this radio? Oh, he's eating him. Oh my god. Hey, man. Oh, my. New notes. It's the cannonball in the kitchen. Don't ask to see my body, Lisa. When I die, when you finish the lawsuits that let you pry this footage from Murkoff's army of lawyers and corporate hitmen, don't make them show you my body. Just bury it or burn it. Let my sons remember me whole. That man is eating human flesh. He looks at me and I see anger. A little desire. But more than anything, hunger. Please don't make them show my body. This poor guy, holy shit. So, I one thing that I like is that, um... He said, please... Um, well not, please don't show my body, sorry. That, that one's a cool word that he said. Um, the therapy is spreading. Meaning everybody is slowly going insane. I, made it. I want them to explore this. Can you climb up? I'm coming, Cooper! I just have to lock the- There. I'm coming! All right. Hold on! I guess I have to go through here. Well, yeah, so everyone's slowly going insane. I know you're close. Oh, fuck me. <laughs> what? Ow. Is he able to walk past this? Yeah, get out of here. Oh, wait. Oh, it's 20 minutes already. All right. It's best not to continue further with that cannibal on the loose. Um, I have to end the video now. Uh, holy shit! Very f cool first start. I I'm loving this DLC. It's great. At last was a fun game already, uh, but this is like, this is something else. I like how we're here during like the beginning of uh, of when everything went to shit and when Billy Hope did his thing. Um, yeah, really cool. Um, if you made it to the end of the video, thank you. You're great, handsome, all of above, and, uh, goodbye.